Well, we all see a lot of other sports and they're professional. Like the way they, the staff, the way the league runs it, the way the players run it, everything's professional. And, and as a person, I want to be professional in everything I do. I want to be the best I can, same with everybody on my team. So if we can take the bits and pieces from other pro teams, whether it's, it's football or hockey, and apply the, the principles behind that to paintball, we're hoping that'll give us another bump up to make us professional paintball players one day. I mean, last year we played them in Richmond Cup, and it was back and forth, back and forth all, all year. They had a, a great winner. They've been playing all the PSPs, and the AXBL is doing, doing awesome. I mean, PSP they did great. AXBL, they, they were the team to beat down there. So we came with a lot of respect. Mark and all those guys trained super hard, and we were hoping just to, to match them in, and come up on top at the end. And unfortunately, or fortunately, we just really got them from the start, maybe got them down, and they, they couldn't recover. The fucking problem with this league is it's so fucking competitive that when you fuck up once like this, now we're out of the race. Our only goal is to not get last. We're in the season for next season. Dropping two losses, now we watch everybody else and hope the best that uh, you know one of our sister teams makes it in. Or two, we're all we're shooting wide. as we're going out. We are not fucking playing with them. They're shooting. We're running right into their paint. It's like, hey, why don't we just give them a game? Fuck it, give them a game. Fuck that shit. You get shot in the back. You get shot in the back. I don't know. I think they lost one or two players, but their guys are their guys are a unit. So I I wouldn't think one or two players would make a difference. Maybe maybe there's some leadership. Maybe there's I don't know, but like I still got mad respect. Those guys are gonna go to PSP and AXBL and do great. So I'm just glad we got them out of the way with a with a big W today. Uh, the Dorito side push on <laughs> the snake side it is so tough. I mean we were a late fill in the snake or just snake one kind of look inside try to stay alive and just just plow down those doritos and unfortunately we were just winning those dorito battles we were shoot, laying in their corners off the break and then they, they get stuck in the pins and we get wide and, and just go down we're gonna have to work twice as hard as we will for this one next event we play rock and roll uh raiders and the all-star game we're the only team with potentially three games in one day so it's going to be super hard but this is confidence and confidence is key so hopefully this is good but I mean, fucking cross the berry, man. They fucking embarrass the fucking show. Well, so we go from taking sixth place at a PSP with five or six fucking guys, and we got our first shot, fucking national shutout at AXBL the weekend before. But, oh, yeah, that's right, we didn't play the fucking flip out. So, uh, what fucking good is that? So, cross the lane, I'm fucking out of this bullshit.